So, you just want a simple seamless texture map, but every now and then you get that one picture that just won't cooperate. Not a problem, in the next two minutes, no picture will dare challenge your will ever again. Alright, let's do this. Go to Colors, Levels, and under Clamp Output, set it to 0.7 and press OK. This just balances the colors. If your picture is not perfectly flat, no big deal. Just click the Perspective tool, and drag the corners, and press Enter until everything is evened out. Then, use the Rectangle tool and select the most usable chunk of the map. Try your best to make it a square, but if you can't, don't worry. Trust me, it'll be fine. Just work with what you got. Then, go to Layers, Transform, and click Width and Height divided by 2. It's gonna shift your image so that you can see the seams. Specifically, it's just moving it halfway to the right and halfway down. Now that we have identified the culprit, here is how you deal with it. Select the Clone Brush and set the size to 280. Now, for those of you who don't know, the Clone Brush is like the king of all brushes. This bad boy is the apex of brush technology. And the way it works is you find a part of the image that you aren't happy with, and then you find a similar part that you are happy with, that you want it to look like. Try to match colors and shades if you can, then hold control and left click on the happy area. Release control and now if you left click and drag here, you'll find that it is copying pieces of the happy area to the current area. And now I will bestow upon you the super secret technique that my ancestors passed on to me. Once you have the happy area selected, Click, undo, click, undo, click, undo, click until you get a match and slowly drag until the problem is gone. And repeat the process until you are happy with what you see. Technically, there's another seam going along here horizontally, but I honestly can't see it and I think it looks fine, so I'm just gonna roll with what I got and fix it up a bit, which you will see in the next tutorial. Hope that helps. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around. Oh, <laughs>